Okay, perfectionism. Let's talk about that. But first, let us find a good spot to shoot. And I'm thinking, on that wall, it's gonna be perfect. But the problem is, how am I gonna get there? Okay, wait, 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 wait. I got an idea. I don't know if it's gonna work, but let's try it out. Are you ready? Okay, there goes nothing. It worked! Yeah! Now you come here. Well, guess what? That worked perfectly. Well, first of all, I'm sorry if it's windy. I don't have a microphone yet. But anyway, okay, so I'm bringing this idea as a personal thought, not like a philosophical video or some shit. Those like three, four years, like people awfully say to me that I'm a perfectionist, but I never understood that perfectly. If that makes any sense. Okay, okay. So, from my own thoughts, perfectionism is what? It is making our work or like accomplishing something the best way possible of accomplishing it from you or from another person. Okay, so. Perfectionism, perfection in something, if perfection in is a word even, but anyway, if somebody comes and tries to make or like do or accomplish the same thing that you did perfectly, you can do it more perfectly than you. That's perfect. <laughs> Does that make any sense for you? That's what, how I think about it, you know. But this perfectionism has two sides. Before we say the two sides, let's change the view. Here, here we go. One, two, three. That was crazy. Okay, I don't want to bore you to death, but let's make this quick. The first side is the good side. I don't know why we start always with the good side. I think it's just a human thing. Anyway, perfectionism will make you go crazy. Like the good crazy, the good kind, not the bad kind. It's gonna show your limits and it's gonna show you how to transcend above these limits. It's a really cool cycle if you look at it positively. You find the thing, the limit, you transit above it, you find the thing, you transit above it, and you develop yourself just like that. You just gotta love the process, you know? Another thing, it's gonna push you to achieve flawlessness, which is impossible because nothing is flawless in this world. But it's gonna help you to smell the smell of flawlessness. You're not gonna achieve it, of course, but you're gonna smell it. Okay, now the drawbacks. Let's go. I don't know why I'm excited to say the drawbacks. It's gonna make you go angry. Perfectionism will make you go angry, like a lot of times. Cause you gotta do something in a certain way and that's uh, not always achievable. Another thing, it's gonna make you critique everything. It's gonna, everything, everything. Like you're gonna critique everything you see, which is a good thing, but sometimes it's a bad thing. Sometimes you're gonna feel like so, 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 so much, very much frustrated because you didn't achieve the thing as perfect as you wanted. Hey, so that's perfectionism from my own personal perspective, of course. And I don't want to say no more because it's going to become boring soon. Now, tell me in the comments what you think about perfectionism from your own perspective. Don't go to Wikipedia or something. And see you soon, very soon. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Here's the sunset for you.